we treated uh, patients um, with uh, relapse and refractory um, uh, Berg lymphoma with Blincyto. This drug is known for ALL, it's approved there. Um, uh, in this relapse refractory patient population, uh, it's really hard uh, yeah, to get this patient in remission, really hard to treat, and uh, yeah, the overall uh, response rates and the cure rates are yeah, not there. So um, uh, what we have, uh, what we tried is to give them a blincito, and we scheduled them on a, we started with a 28 microgram per day uh, for four days, and then we escalated to 112 microgram and treated them for 52 days. So this is the, we call it in the action phase. And then we did two cycles of consolidation phase and four cycles of maintenance. So um, yeah, we actually treated three patients. So it's really early data there. But, um, we have uh, two patients that did not respond to Plincito, but have one patient that really gets into a complete remission after one cycle. Um, after this, this we tried to consolidate them, him with an um, autologous transplant. Um, was then also in CR, but relapsed really early, one month uh, later, with uh, Burkitt leukemia. So we did him on retreatment with Blincito and get a CR and uh, did the consolidation and maintenance phase. Now the patient is uh, one year off treatment, still in MRD, negative remission, so recovered really great, did long term, long run, long distance runs, and really happy uh, to have these results with him. Well, yeah, what we uh, do with the Blincito and Burkitt's is we do an IIT and uh, do a trial there uh, within the German, German ALL group and uh, hopefully this will start end of the year.